Welcome, fight fans, to Hard Case Locker Fanatics. Today, we lace up our gloves and step into the ring with a legend, Iron Mike himself, Mike Tyson. Tyson, a name synonymous with power, speed, and devastating knockouts, he took the boxing world by storm, becoming the youngest heavyweight champion ever. Buckle up because we're reliving Tyson's fury with a compilation of his most brutal knockouts. So hit that subscribe button, smash that notification bell, and get ready for a knockout punch of nostalgia. This is Hard Case Locker Fanatics. all the hard work mm -hmm. and I like to say hello to all my family back home I knew from the beginning but everybody else knew that yeah. it was no comp it was no comp that's like the rest of it. a lot of people came to look Jesse Ferguson came to look the Frazier's came yeah. to look James Broad was out there Think, all of you all of you come get some Mike Tyson's out here he's waiting for you all come get some number one Mike Tyson versus Trevor Burbick Round 2 Knockout Mike Tyson's match against Trevor Burbick on November 22, 1986 remains one of the most iconic moments in boxing history. Tyson, at just 20 years old, was challenging for the WBC heavyweight title. From the opening bell, Tyson's relentless aggression and unparalleled power were evident. Burbick, a seasoned fighter, found himself overwhelmed by Tyson's speed and precision. In the second round, Tyson delivered a series of brutal combinations, culminating in a devastating left hook that sent Burbick to the canvas. Although Burbick tried to stand, his legs betrayed him and he stumbled multiple times before the referee called the fight. The referee stepped in, waving off the fight and Mike Tyson was declared the winner by knockout at 2 minutes and 35 seconds of the second round. With this victory, Tyson not only claimed the WBC heavyweight title, but also etched his name into the annals of boxing history as the youngest heavyweight champion ever. Number 2. Mike Tyson vs. Michael Spinks Round 1 Knockout On June 27, 1988, Mike Tyson faced Michael Spinks in a bout that was billed as one of the biggest fights in heavyweight history. Spinks, an undefeated former light heavyweight champion, was expected to provide a stern test for Tyson. However, the fight turned out to be a showcase of Tyson's ferocity. From the outset, Tyson charged at Spinks, landing powerful body shots and head punches. Just 91 seconds into the first round, Tyson delivered a crushing right-hand uppercut followed by a left hook, sending Spinks to the canvas. Spinks couldn't beat the count and Tyson's first round knockout victory solidified his status as the undisputed heavyweight champion of the world. Number 3. Mike Tyson vs. Larry Holmes Round 4 Knockout When Mike Tyson faced Larry Holmes on January 22, 1988, it was seen as a clash between a rising star and a former champion. Holmes, who had been retired for nearly two years, was coaxed back into the ring to challenge the young champion. Tyson dominated the fight from the beginning, showcasing his trademark speed and power. In the fourth round, Tyson unleashed a series of ferocious combinations, finishing with a right hook that floored Holmes. Despite Holmes' experience and resilience, he couldn't withstand Tyson's relentless assault and was knocked down three times in the round before the fight was stopped. This victory further solidified Tyson's reputation as the most feared fighter in the division. Number 4. Mike Tyson vs. Frank Bruno Round 5 Knockout On February 25, 1989, Mike Tyson defended his heavyweight titles against Frank Bruno in a highly anticipated bout. 
Bruno, a British heavyweight with a powerful punch, managed to stun Tyson early in the first round with a strong right hand. However, Tyson quickly regained control, using his superior speed and agility to outmaneuver Bruno. By the fifth round, Tyson had found his rhythm, landing precise and powerful combinations. A right hook followed by a flurry of punches left Bruno defenseless against the ropes. The referee intervened, stopping the fight and awarding Tyson a fifth round knockout victory. This fight showcased Tyson's ability to recover from adversity and finish his opponents with ruthless efficiency. Number 5. Mike Tyson vs. Marvis Frazier Round 1 Knockout Mike Tyson's bout against Marvis Frazier on July 26, 1986 is a testament to his explosive power and aggressive style. Frazier, the son of former heavyweight champion Joe Frazier, was expected to pose a significant challenge. However, Tyson wasted no time in establishing his dominance. Within the first 30 seconds of the fight, Tyson cornered Frazier and unleashed a barrage of punches. A devastating uppercut lifted Frazier off his feet and knocked him out cold. The referee immediately stopped the fight, declaring Tyson the winner by knockout just 30 seconds into the first round. This victory was one of the quickest and most brutal in Tyson's career, underscoring his reputation as a knockout artist. Number 6. Mike Tyson vs. Carl Williams Round 1 Knockout on July 21, 1989, Mike Tyson faced Carl, the Truth Williams, in a defense of his undisputed heavyweight championship. Williams, known for his height and reach advantage, was expected to give Tyson a tough fight with his jab and boxing skills. However, Tyson had other plans. From the opening bell, Tyson moved aggressively, slipping Williams' jabs and closing the distance. Less than two minutes into the first round, Tyson landed a perfectly timed left hook that sent Williams sprawling to the canvas. Despite Williams' attempts to rise, the referee halted the fight, awarding Tyson a knockout victory at 1 minute and 33 seconds of the first round. This quick and decisive win highlighted Tyson's ability to neutralize taller opponents with his explosive power and relentless pressure. Number 7 Mike Tyson vs. Bruce Seldon Round 1 Knockout On September 7, 1996, Mike Tyson challenged Bruce Seldon for the WBA heavyweight title in what became another showcase of Tyson's devastating knockout power. Seldon, known as the Atlantic City Express, was expected to utilize his jab and movement to keep Tyson at bay. However, Tyson's intensity and aggression were overwhelming from the start. Just 109 seconds into the first round, Tyson landed a crushing right hand followed by a left hook, which caused Seldon to stagger and fall. Although Seldon managed to get up, he was visibly shaken, and another powerful right hand from Tyson sent him to the canvas again. The referee stopped the fight, declaring Tyson the winner by knockout. This victory not only earned Tyson the WBA title, but also demonstrated his ability to dismantle his opponents with sheer power and speed. Number 8. Mike Tyson vs. Henry Tillman Round 1 Knockout On June 16, 1990, Mike Tyson faced Henry Tillman a former Olympic gold medalist who had defeated Tyson twice in the amateurs. This bout was seen as an opportunity for Tyson to avenge his earlier losses and reassert his dominance in the heavyweight division. From the outset, Tyson was aggressive, determined to erase any doubts about his prowess. Just over two minutes into the first round, Tyson cornered Tillman and unleashed a vicious right hand to the head followed by a series of powerful punches that sent Tillman crashing to the canvas. The referee immediately stepped in to stop the fight, awarding Tyson a knockout victory at 2 minutes and 47 seconds of the first round. 
This emphatic win not only avenged Tyson's amateur losses, but also reaffirmed his status as one of the most feared knockout artists in boxing history. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video for more. Until next time, Hardcase Locker Fanatics is signing off.